Hello and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Samantha. I travel out of my 2001 Chevy Astro van part-time at the moment. I am at my house and I just wanted to do a video the rest of this week about basically what I take on a four to five day camping trip with me. I'm gonna be camping with my family next weekend. So I'm starting to prepare things now and I just wanna bring you guys along throughout the week and show you what I bring, um, what new products I've purchased to try in the van, what old products I still use in the van, and show you the fully packed van um, at the end of the week when I'm ready to go. And I recently purchased my own portable battery station. If you have seen in my videos, I used to borrow my dad's 300 watt rock pal battery station and I've used that on every single trip I've been on thus far. But since I'm camping with my dad this weekend, um, he's gonna need that for his um, stuff. So I purchased this EcoFlow, which is the 1600 watt battery generator. It gives out 800 watts. And I'm gonna open it right now. I haven't even opened it yet. I'm gonna get it charged up. And then later on, um, I'm gonna show you guys the things it can power and test it out. So this is gonna be my first time seeing it. I'm so excited. I went ahead and purchased it because they were doing a sale um, on Amazon and on their website. I'm thinking that this is gonna be enough power for me because I currently just run my um, refrigerator. That's pretty much the only thing I have running at all times. And then I just have to charge up my phone, um, camera batteries, and laptop sometimes. So I was hope thinking that this would be good enough for now, for now at least. So here's a little manual. has one right here on the back which is pretty cool so far it's pretty easy to pick up and whatnot I like that it's flat because you can like set down your phone or if you're charging something set it down up here so it's got a USB A charger a USB C charger regular USBs it has DC power, so I'll be running my fridge off of DC right there, and then four AC outlets. market here it's called Boa Vista Apple Hill Farms and I'm gonna do some shopping for my camping trip um, I leave in about two days so I'm gonna do some shopping today here and I think at Target I'll show you guys what I get it's Apple parking you can't park here mm -hmm. you can only park here if you have an iPhone okay no Android it's the iPhone. It's the mm -hmm. Apple. And then you have the literal fruit of Apple. Yes. So this place is open 363 days a year and they do different events. So like last time we came it was peach days, today's blueberry days. 
think I might try, or not blueberry, it's blackberry day Riz. this time. I think we're gonna try a blackberry uh, donut. And then I wanna grab some fruit for my trip and we might get cider too. Oh wait, Wait, so let's check it first. Should we grab the donut first? Yeah. And then, do you want to do the cider? Uh, I want to see how much it is. I forgot. Okay. Ooh, yeah, or we could just lemonade. we could just get one cider to share. Yeah. Is the apple cider good? Because you got that last time. Does it make the thing dirty? I don't know. Yeah, it's pretty good. Ooh, yeah, so they have blackberry donut, blackberry apple. The cutest bamboo utensils. I have a spoon and a spatula from here. Peaches. This is the main reason why I'm here. These elegant lady ones, so good. The white peaches are pretty good too. Let's go try our donut. All right, you guys. We are gonna do a fruit and vegetable haul right now from Boa Vista. So the main reason I came back was to get more peaches. They're so good. These are Elegant Lady and these are white peaches. I'm gonna take this camping with me. Then we got some nice looking strawberries and blackberries. Those look really nice. I think better than the last time. Ooh, they smell good. And then I have a yellow onion. This is gonna be for curry. I'm gonna cook that while camping. Oh, more peaches? What were those, nectarines? Oh, those are nectarines. These are the white peaches. And then I got three potatoes for curry and a bell pepper for curry. Is this bin? I found it at Walmart. It's a bin that I can slide under my bed, and right now it's holding all of my like 
kitchy or like right now it's holding all of my cooking stuff so i have my collapsible sink plate pan pot three cans of butane for my stove some extra utensils my spatula spoon strainer can opener some ziploc bags some cabbage or some kimchi cabbage um these are some s'more sticks my mom got me extend and then just some liners good morning you guys so i am all packed up as you can see the van is pretty full today i'm leaving for my camping trip i am meeting my family there and i just want to leave it a surprise until the next video so i will catch y'all in the next video when i'm at my campground <laughs>